Hello valued viewers, I hope you're all doing very well. About a week ago, we did this video, does camouflage help with intercepts and close-in dogfights? And we got Cortana and Cortana's friends to come in and played against us and to do a semi-scientific slash fun battle. And so we want to do it again. In fact, we want to do a whole bunch of them. Today is going to be, can World War II aircraft defend a base against early Cold War jet fighters and bombers and we're going to do a whole series of tests cortana can you uh, give us some more detail please the warbirds have to defend a target so it's not like we're gonna have to chase the jets down they're gonna come to us it makes us a little more relevant than we uh, we otherwise would be so in terms of the jets we have b-52s and f-86 escorts that are ai and can be spawned independently so we can all be on the warbird side um, depending on what we're trying to do and then I also have player jets that spawn at Cardenville. You guys can either escort the bombers or attack on your own. And that, that'll just give us some more variety. And in addition to the F-86, we also have the MiG-15, our other Gen 1 fighter. And then uh, we also have Gen 2 fighters, F-5s. Uh, we have um, MiG-19s. And we also have MiG-21s. I also just for, for giggles, included the MB339 and the the A10 to see if, um, essentially how that would sort of hold up. And then in terms of the Warbirds, we literally have everything except for the Mozzie and the P47, just because they, they prove to be a little bit too slow. We'll do a series of tests. Some will be PVE, some will be PVP. And at the end of it, we're going to get a good feel for how well World War II aircraft can do against early Cold War jets and bombers. Why are we doing this? There's no real reason. It's fun and it interests us. Guys, any comments before we start? Mm -hmm. I think against the AI, we're going to do pretty well just because they tend to do relatively predictable things. I think the PVP is where it's going to get really interesting. I think that's going to be much, much harder. Welcome into round one. This is Grim Reapers and Cortana's gang versus the AI. Uh, B-52s, and are they going to have sabers as well, uh, Cortana? If you click the right button, yes. Okay, give them sabers or as I well. Click the button. Yeah, I'm going to let okay. you do that now, Cortana. You spawn them in, and as soon as you've spawned them in, you start going. I think Cortana's at the front. Lead rolling. Got quite a lot to take off, so keep your speed relatively low until we're blobbed up. Roger. Uh, we're on the Normandy map today, viewers. Oh, the sound of that is unbelievable. Nice, isn't it? You've got Mercedes B12s, you've got Jumo B12s, you've got um, US manufactured Merlins, whatever they called them, I can't remember. A lot of B12s, basically. Oh, someone died. Don't worry, I'll cut that out of the video. Has to be a Grim Reaper, doesn't it? Right, super cap, punching <laughs> it. All right, gonna start a left orbit over the fields, climbing up to 3,000 feet to start. Airborne. Look at me. I can take off finally properly from this thing. You just had to do like three videos in a row. Sure. And ruin it for the valued viewers. It bounces on takeoff. I'm just not used to a cap gun test. Alrighty then. Come in, Cortana. Guys, sort your RPMs out. Uh, Cortana's guys will sort themselves out. My guys, get max continuous. Do it now before you fry your engines, please. Valued viewers, if you're watching this and you're interested in warbirds, which you should be by the way, because they're so much more interesting than any jet ever made. Uh, they're really interesting. You've got to constantly maintain your engine. All these gauges here, and it's a, uh, it's a constant job, and it makes any mission very satisfying. Oh, look at the Cortana gang up there all showing off. I can do that if I wanted. So any, kind of, any kind of speed, guys? I'm trying. Bloody Germans. I'm too afraid to look down at my yep. instruments. Uh, Cortana Blob is pretty much with you, apart from Crazy Guy keeps crashing. Uh, please, can you uh, do whatever we're supposed to do? We're in your hands. All right, so... Yep, got eyes on them as well. All right, so we're almost co-out with the B-52s. The Sabres are a thousand feet above them. 
Um, what we might want to do is, um, eh, I don't know, let's just go for it. So. What Cortana says, let's do it. Guys, we're climbing, so watch your T's and P's. You do not want to blow your engine up before we get there. Yep, That's I'm going to give us a light climb here. Can move into formation for cool visuals. I say light climb as if I'm not going to, you know. Watch out of interest, that thing there is well over, well over, I think 2100 horsepower. Really impressive Juma win. Mustang's about 16, 1700. I guess it depends what fuel it was running, wasn't it, guys? I don't know what fuel would be running. I think you've got 100 in in that, but late in the war they would have been running like 150, I think it was. Roger, so probably near two, more <laughs> near 2000 horsepower. The uh, Kurfus probably at 1800 horsepower with MW, I imagine. Correct me if I'm wrong, guys. I-16, measly 1000 horsepower, but it's a much earlier generation. Yep, go ahead and go for a combat spread. All right. Get your bolts spread on you. We'll uh, go ahead and get sort of in front of them. And if people want to fan out, and the idea is some of us will attack from, um, from directly in front and then loop over. And then we'll have some people sort of attack from the sides and just sort of pull like a Cuban 8. Yep. All right, they've entered the combat area. We are free to engage. This is where VR is useful, viewers. You can see stuff far away. I can't do it on the track I am. I'm just going to pull up Cortana. Oh. Somebody's going to come in from the left side of the bandits. All right. Negative ketchup. Are, 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 are we all I'm going for the bombers, left. guys? Affirmative, yep. If we don't take out the bombers, then they win 100% of the time. All right. I've got eyes on a set of four F-86 trailing the bombers by a few kilometers. It might be oh, worth okay. one warbird just smashing into the F-86s to deliberately distract them. And that will give us more time on the bombers. If they have to break in formation. Oh, shit. Uh, I'm following you. They're passing over the, for the, the forest right now. Emily? And they're banking. All right, here we go. Simba's running in. I saw the damn bombers. Talk me through it, Cortana. Wait, tell me when you're merging. Merged. One B-52 down. Yeah, I see him. Some I mistaken him. hits. I can be doing oh, damage and fucking out. Her B-52 is out. Well done, guys. No one escapes Warbird. I just clean up the F-86s for the lols. Uh, yep. I'm smoking down low, and I got an F-86 on me. Nice. down. Buff down. On an F-86? Well, uh, I'm going to meet the farmer's daughter. No respawning. Where was the door at? Help me out with that F-86, thank you. Pull those G's, pull those G's, load it up. I'm gonna oh. come around the circle uh, the other direction and try to go beat to beat with them. We are gonna smash these guys, we're maneuvering. Oh shit, I'm in trouble. You twat! Oh, shut the pieces. Dive, dive. Oh, too late. <coughs> I'm out. Good luck, guys. Kill those knobs. I'm dead, stop shooting me. I'm out with you. Oh, I see the one that just got you, Cap. Rowenda. F-86 down. F-86 smoking. Beautiful. Well done. But do not okay, crash. There's flash. Oh, he's got okay, one behind me. I was losing my engine. I lost a wing, but I survived. Catch up. Catch up. You catch up if you come straight down okay, right underneath you. Stuck to me. Straight down and then a turn to the south would be nice. Flash F-86. 
He punched. Nice. West one more. I'm in the area where East all the parachutes are. <laughs> I'm on the six of an F-86. Go on, Violet. Smack him. Searching. Molly. Uh, Molly Woo. All boats should be in every friggin' fight. Tally one F-86. Is that all the merch? No, there's two. Cannonball's got one and the rest of, is on the other. But they're both under threat. Neither are aggressive. So you're all good. You time up Cannonball while the guy smashes this other guy. It's on the 86. Punch him on your stupid feet. Ah, just apparently mistimed it. Man, his kinematics are good. Some of you guys can try to cut across the circle rather than chasing them right. around. Right, yep. yep. Someone's, someone's got to cut that shit. One or two people uh, try to just keep him forced into this circle and then uh, everyone else try to seek advantage. Cold's in the 109's off, Winchester. Mm. I'm gonna look for a head on here. Oh, behind. Shots I mean, we're gonna win it eventually. He'll run out of gas before we, uh, before we do. Oh no, what did you do, Violet? All right. All right, guys, I'm gonna terminate there because um, I have proof of concept done. Pausing. Uh, that was already easy, right? What do you wanna do next? Cortana, some PvP? Welcome in. Next round, PvP. So, defending are Reds, which is Cortana's group in Warbirds. Six of them. And my guys, the attackers, will be in early Cold War jets, which the MB-339 is going to be representing an old shooting star or something, I suppose. Guys, tactics. Um, I mean, there's no point of just getting in a big dogfight with them, but that's not going to help. Maybe have two guys assigned to dogfight them and keep them tangled up in sabers, and the rest just attack fire trucks. Brakes on, but and punch it. My tiny little 5,000 horsepower, 4,000 horsepower, whatever we've got. We'll get some speed out there, don't worry. Releasing MB339s, punch it. All right, viewers. Yay, finally got to fly this. Little Italian trainer slash light attack aircraft. When do we rotate, bird? It's about 120? 120-ish, yeah. You got it, baby. Saber. Saber spool and release. Airborne. She's a fighter. Where's our flap conditions? I'm not sure. And your flap position is, uh, well, it should visual. be now. One yeah, above 150. Visual. Guys, I'm on the left orbit. Let's have a total of zero crashes on the runway, please. The Saber's taking off and not crashing. I'm so proud. Sabres, don't underestimate them, valued viewers. They are very fast aircraft. They'll go, I don't actually know, probably 600 knots. Very fast aircraft. Tight left, guys. Right. You know what? They'll see us if we go high. Caps in the deck. Do it with me, please. It's a thing. Wow, I'm 350 knots, guys. This plane's a rocket ship. Nearly 400 knots. Is that you in the lead there, Cap? You got it. I'm yeah, we're going, buzzing the beach here. We're going for pure kinematic power here. When I say kinematic power value viewers, a lot of you think I mean cinematic. No, kinematic with a K. Movement of objects in a closed system. I'm nearly ready for my left turn. God knows what War Dogs is doing. I guess he's just being War Dogs. But the rest of you, left ball, two zero zero. Guys, when we're on left, when we're on two zero zero, I'm going to unleash sabers to go and cause havoc. Because you just want to go as fast as you can. There's no point of going in formation. I'm nearly 500 knots. Yep. Wow. Viewers, have you ever seen a 339 do this? There is no prop plane in the world, I don't think, that can do this. Maybe a bear or something? We're in the combat area. Alrighty <laughs> then. Use your F-10. It's there, so use it. I'll be there in a few seconds. Tally Warbirds. All right, Violet, you're a what killer. What altitude? Engage. Co altitude. On her nose, cannonball. Does anyone know if they got AAA at the base? I've got to check. Look how fast this plane can go. No, well, that makes it useful in actual missions. We can actually use it for something. If we got a chance to do core game again, probably never will do. Visual air base. Running in. All right, viewers, watch this. Cortana's going to be so freaking angry. 
I'm gonna go for the trailing one. 450 knots. Fire truck identified. Now, do they have AAA? Do they have AAA? I think they do. I think they've got a friggin' Sam. Yep, lots of AAA. Lots of AAA. Oh, this gun sight's terrible. One truck down, one truck down. Wow! Oh, load of G, load of G. Woo! Someone get an eye on what type of AAA it is, it will help. Cap running in for second Looks attack. Looks like 23 Mike, Mike Bofors. Oh, God. It was somewhere around the... Um... Did Bofors make 23 Mike Mike? They made 40. <coughs> well, whatever, the one in the little encampments. Oh, that's nasty, Russian gear. Two fire trucks down. Keep we going, guys. If you can, try and attack from a radial where there's less AAA. But I don't know what that is yet. Tally Warbirds. Oh, that's Cortana, getting all stewed up and angry. Cap running in for next kill. Trying to get as fast as I can, viewers. There are Warbirds knots. all over the base. That's a them problem. Running in. I just had one do a shot in my canopy. Fire engine found. Oh, someone just crashed. Please don't do that, guys. That's not help our cause at all. I've got hydraulic issues. God. I over g that low altitude. 98% damage on a fire truck. God, no, that's unlucky. unlucky. Bye, Warbird. Yep, you can't keep up with me. I'm going to do something that I may regret, but... I'm going to perform an... Uh, what were we performing here? Cubanate. It's been on Cubanate. It gives me a chance to look at targets. Cap running in. I've got no warbirds on me. My speed is making me impervious. Somebody's got a warbird on them. Well, I've lost my engine now, finally. Damn it. Try and distract them till you're dead. Running in. The fire trucks. Can we Fox 4? Yep. Do it. Use it on the fire truck. Get it accurate. Hits. Oh my. Splash another one. Shack, whatever. Words. Fall down. Six to go. Get off. Oh, okay. Apparently that didn't even touch the fire truck even though I was on it. My airman attack works perfectly, guys. Oh no, my engine's shutting down. Oh, 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 super cap. What happened? I'm out of fuel. Where's the fuel meter, guys? No, you've got plenty of fuel. 314 is that big digit. Is you got half a gas. I don't know, something... Something happened. Oh, sorry, viewers. A thing happened. I don't know what happened. All right, I'm going to try and use my face. I've got some... I do see you have some damage, so maybe the oil yeah. pressure just lost like some mine. some mechanical energy. Damn, we killed five as well. All right, I'm going to jump my face into one. For shavers, I need you to start shooting these fire engines. Like, now. Copy. If you can see the four smokestacks, there's some to the... Um, I don't know how to describe this, but the east of it, Tally to the right of the it. smoke if you're looking north. Fire that's rolling in. Ouch. Get off, Cortana. Oh, she shot me just before I hit the truck. I can control it. I can control this. Yes. Fire Fire dad. Let's see who's alive. There's three of you left. Fire truck destroyed. Well done. Do violet things. Fire trucks, big red fire trucks. Oh no, Cortana just took a smash. God damn it! Pilot's out. Oh man, that's gonna be a hard pull-up fight. Oh, we lost his oh. wing. Oh, ah, you were surrounded by fighters. Oh, that's a, is it? That, no, one more cannonball. cannonball. All cannonball right. Remaining. No pressure. No pressure. Yep. No, there's lots of pressure. Okay, some fire trucks there on the aprons. The little aprons. Oh, both force got me. Not many left to kill. Kill. Good kill. One right next to it. Just keep that speed high. Yeah, there's very little they can do. You might want to roll to your right and come back in on the other angle. It's going to be a harder angle than this one. They're going to burn their engines out trying to catch up with you. It's got to be irritating for them just to watch them fly away. <laughs> okay, you've outrun everyone by miles. They've all turned off you. Three left. Three left. All right, here we go. Be heroic. All right, stupid warbirds, suck on this. Oh, 
Oh, someone just busted you. The speed! 600 knots! The speed! Watch your overspeed. I didn't get anywhere near you. Approximately 1500 whatever gallons. I need pounds. Cannonball be advised, you are down a rudder. Anywhere near that. Yeah, they're burning the ranges out trying to get you. This makes me happy. A lot of the boat pools are out of ammo. Here comes Simba. Still one boat Here comes Simba. Oh, miss. Quite one down. more, That's one more. Shack. Right there in front of the big hang. Yep, there you go. Dang it, 91%. <laughs> Do it again. So you have two of them that are left at 91%, right in line with each other. I'm watching Cortana. She is literally stewing in her own juices. So angry right now. What I'm really worried about is how much ammunition I have left. Oof. All right. You have your face. Come on, Grim Reapers. Come on, Grim Reapers. Grim Reapers, best Reapers? Oh my god, they're getting close. To, they're figuring out your attack. They're learning to hit you. Come on, cannibal. Yeah, shoot his face. Yes! Yeah! yeah! Yes. Eject, eject over the field to rub it in. Ha 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 ha! Superior victory! I'll bring him in. Oh, you made us work for it, guys. You made us work for it. Last man, and he was half dead. Just managed it. How was it from Warbird's point of view? Hard. Challenging. Mm hmm. It was the speed. A lot of chasing. It was the speed, right? Oh yeah. I mean, we were at, we were at the point where we had one or two people shadowing mm -hmm. to call out the direction he was attacking from, and the rest of us were trying to go beak to beak mm -hmm. with him and if, get a lucky cannon hit. And if that was AI, you would ease that because it, the AI doesn't have common sense to oh, do yeah. boom and zoom. But a human would do boom and zoom. All right. How do you feel about um, the same thing? But swap side, it's but swap teams over. You think you guys could do that defending AI bombers? We've already done that. Because that'd be hard. I mean, that time you guys were the aggressors and you didn't have to worry about protecting anything, like the bombers. Roger, do you, are you saying you want us to uh, defend the B 52s? Defend the B 52s. All right. Welcome in, viewers. Next, we are having Cortana's lot with Simba defending again in Warbirds. Grim Reapers are now going to be in early Cold War you know, 1940s, 1950s jets again. But we're going to be defending the low-level bombers. Oh, it's such a cute little plane. It is cute. It's awesome plane. Someday you'll grow up and be a real plane. Yes. Uh, brakes on, power on. Three, two, one, punch it. Yeah, we're so freaking cool. I'm doing this whole thing from external view. I'm so freaking awesome. Okay. Saber's ready. Okay. Number one, or Saber going. Right. Calling the bombers. Right, I've got to find the B-52s, guys. I see them. Right, I'm going to go up and dive down on them because I don't know what their speeds are. About 250 according to F10. Wow, that's slow. I guess. Yeah, the only... Warbirds had no trouble shooting them down. Yeah, if you wonder why they're going so. I didn't make this mission, Cortana did, but Cortana's made it so that they have to be, you know, relatively vulnerable. So they're, I guess they're going to be representing low level prop bombers or something at that speed. Guys, how do we want to protect them? Do we want to have the Sabres going out, clearing ahead? I don't know. How do you want to do it? Talk me through. I think. Maybe we'll go in ahead, try to blaze a path. All right, do it, but not like 20 miles ahead. Do it like five miles ahead. In fact, you can probably just go now thinking about it, Sabres. We're quite, we're making tracks towards that. I don't remember Cortana saying about anything that we had to stick with the bombers, like super tight, so Sabres off your poop. They'll probably, if I were them, I'll be high diving down. So look high. Hi. 
Well, I hope this damage model was a tough, because I reckon those buffs would take a lot of damage. You'll they, be happy to know. They about didn't before. Oh, that's problematic then. But if viewers, you'll be happy to know I've finally given up, gone to the doctors, and I've got some antibiotics from my cold. Hello, fellow MB339. I'm a fan of the plane. I think it's cool. Anything a bit quirky like this, I think it's a cool plane. About a hour. I'm going to go I'm out. doing S turns over the bombers so I can right. see planes better. Yep, fill it <coughs> Tally forward. I'm Flash. diving down on him. Wow. He's down low. Violet the frigging killer. That's going to upset Cortana. He's stewing in our own juices even more than normal. <laughs> Remember his best readers? I do have a pretty big hole in my left wing. Yeah, don't worry about that. Trim it out. Yeah, something like that. Well, that man said, do a thing. Show yourselves. I haven't seen one yet, but have you seen anything? Nope. I'm seeing where Violet is on F10. I'm trying to look that way to see if I see anything. There's coming. one hanging out in the smoke ring, just inside the smoke ring on my side. God, I can't see them, viewers. They're so hard to see. Warbirds are so hard to see. Big F15, easy to see. Warbird, hard to see. I this guy's Christmas tree. Is he high or low? Down low, down low. Oh, right, full so. Right inside the ring, below the bombers. I'm going. Directly below the bomber. I'm right. on a six. I'm going right there. Keep him busy. It will take him a bit of time to get up there. Hits, hits, hits. Well done. Good hits. Cap's down there as well. Oh shit, one's there. Ah, okay, you sucker. First one missed. That's got to be the boss. Ah, come on. There's a coup first is in here. I'm all over him like a cheap suit. Come oh, on, pull. Yes, I'm all over him and he can't escape me. All right, knobhead. Suck on this. I've scared him off. Gotta be Simba. Respect my authority. Farmer down. Damn it. Do what you can't do, mate. Shit, I got thoroughly beaten by a cut first nine. I'm getting the shit out of here. Two bombers down. No! They distracted me! I'm Three coming. bombers down. Ah! Get off! Can't get there in time. Sabres. One bomber theft, and one bomber can win this, remember? I'm going to the bomber. No, there's a warbird there! Screw you! I'm blacked out. Don't do that, Gordon. Ah, oh, damn it. We're getting straight. He's down. Third ball. Ah, down. damn it. We were so close. Look how close we were. In fact, where's the freaking base? All right. Knock it off. You're just coming in from all angles. It was impossible to stop you. Glad to hear. Yeah. Uh, what do you want to do next, guys? I'd kind of like a chance to uh, sure. to uh, go on the attack. Um, what are you going to go in? I'll probably go and make 15. Next, it's going to be us, Grim Reapers and Warbirds, defending. And they are going to be in... They're not going to have bombers. They're just going to be in the early Cold War. So the 40s and early 50s jets, uh, which I am worried about. So, uh, stand by. The key for us is going as fast as we can, as high as we can, as fast as we can. And just hoping to put them off, put the aim off, run them out of ammo. We're not going to win. We're not going to get them into dogfights. They're too clever for that. If you crash and take off, I will let you have another life. But otherwise, no respawning. All right, viewers, wish us the best of luck. I can't see any way winning this, to be honest, but we'll do our best. All right, viewers, I'm going to max continuous, and I'm going to climb as high as I can and try and dive down on the savers or some such. Or if you just open both uh, coolers. It, really? Uh, it'll handle fine quite well for a good time. Oops. Did you notice? Know, I'm at 2,000 feet per minute. So we've got five minutes, that's 10,000 feet we can get to. Try not to get sucked away from the base, guys. Nothing will be achieved by attacking them 10 miles away. They'll just outrun you and you won't even get an attack. So I'd suggest circling over the base at 10,000 feet, doing nice big dives, try not to get compression. Though, if you can get them into compressibility. Right. They're too experienced, so they'll never do it. Cortana's guys are so much more experienced than us, some of them ex pilots and stuff like that, so. And watch for tracers from the base, that'll help identify them. Mm -hmm. 5,000 feet. This thing climbs like a beast. I'm up at 7.6. Uh, let me guess, you're in a spit. 
Nope, must huh. But I wouldn't suggest getting above 10, guys. If you go above 10, you're just going to get too fast and you're going to crash on your first hit. Oh, there you are, bird. The bird. Why am I, aren't you? I'm so yeah. high. All right, 8,000 feet, leveling out. Okay, my VNE is 500 miles an hour. How many knots? That's about 450 knots. Okay, I should be able to catch the MB339. In fact, are they flying? Simba, F86, Cortana, MiG-15. Oh, they're super cheeky. They've got fast planes only, really fast planes. Oh, well. Guys, I can't see this going very well. We should see their smoke trails then quite easily, at least the MiGs, right? Oh, yeah, I see the smoke trail. They're coming in a nice group. What ang where? Heading, bearing, whatever. They are uh, over the center of the smoke stacks. Do what? Uh, east? All right, straight towards us. How high? I would say at about seven to 8,000 feet. Ah, Tully. Tully Bay, you see that valley for yours? Those little marks there, they're going to come in at max speed. I think I'm going to go for an initial head on attack. And then I'm going to defend the base. Might get some lucky shots. If you're going to go on a head on attack, try and use their smoke to get the perfect radial. <laughs> the high ones could be decoys. Yeah, I'm not going for that guy. I haven't got the engine power for yeah, that. Yeah, I can't climb that. God, they're fast. Okay. Hostiles heading in for our um, airfield. The guy that was high is now diving in. Yep, I'm diving in behind him. Enjoy. Both fours are firing. Yep. Up. Pilot diving in. Oh, they've got rockets. I didn't know that we could have rockets. Oh, man. Oh, I'm gutted. I didn't even think we could have rockets. I don't think about that either. That's just cheating. We didn't They're use rockets. They're attacking our AAA. Oh, that's allowed. All right, guys. 400 friggin' miles an hour. T's and P's are good. They're turning to come back in. Okay. Sabres re-attacking. T's and P's. I'm just on the limit, backing off now. I think a MiG-15's coming back in for a dive run. Oh, shag. I can't see it. Oh, I'm spitting distance, guys. I'm friggin' spitting distance. I don't have the temperatures. They're diving, F-86 diving back in now. Hits on Simba. Yes, well done. I'm much closer this time. Three firefighting vehicles till they I might get hit. I just realized we're freaking coordinated. Break off of Simba, he's trying to drag us away. More hits on Simba. If all I do is kill Simba, I'll be happy. Yeah. T's and P's are good. Might get a shot here. Ah, oh, I'm gonna stall. He's gonna stall too. Alright then. Sucker. I'm getting closer every time. There are three fire trucks left. Oh shit. I've got him this time. Someone just made a boom and zoom. I have you now. I have you now. I think Stepo's about to die. He's dead. Go down, go down. Peace and peace, good. Ah, oh, damn it! Oh. Sons of bitches. Alright. I didn't know we could have rockets. Never mind. Never known, guys. Yeah. So, uh. Mm. Gen 2. Oof. Our viewers, we're second gen 1960s aircraft with rockets and guns. We haven't taken any Fox 2 missiles because I assume I'm, I'm making the assumption that's against um, protocol. Right, bird, please take off and go straight to target. We're not going to do any silly business. Pretty much burn. Spooling up. And three, two, one, release burn. I've got them so fast compared to you guys. Carefully do throttle cannon pull. This front way is not suitable for jets.
Everyone, yeah. Alrighty. How they work, sweet. Cam works. Alright All right, guys. Just full full burn straight in, are we going? Pretty much, yep. There's no compressibility. These are proper 1960s aircraft. Go fast and shoot stuff. I'm so fast compared to you guys. You know me, I don't, don't like to boast about trading, things, but... Trading speed for altitude right now. There you go, and your tiny little eco-savers. Only me one thing. Boom, boom time. Alright. Right. I'm gonna go fast in that. How many knots are we, Lee? Uh, 300 increasing. Right, stick to your objective, guys. Win by killing the things, not the planes. These are not suitable planes for dogfighting warbirds. Target is off the nose. 400 knots. Once I'm right below them, I'm gonna pop up and then dive down on the base. We're diving now. Okay, watch this, humanoids. Hey, you bought my frigging base. I'm doing like 700 knots. They're not catching up with me, ever. Oh, sweet. someone went boom boom. Someone's dead already. I got hit by flat. That's unfortunate. Shack one. Woo. Full burner on the way out. Yep. Climbing again. Look at that. No, no more bird catching that up, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Well, Tana must be stewing more than normal. 400 knots. And diving in. For humanoids. Look at that silly vain attempt to try and stop us. Oh, I'm in. Wow. Ow. Boat force got me. Ah, that is annoying, guys. Those boat force can be rather... Track three. Yeah, those boat force shouldn't even be able to target planes this fast. Actually, I'm not sure that's correct. It wasn't the boat force, you just overloaded your wing. Yeah, don't do stupid death style, guys. There's no need for it. There are three remaining. Oh, need to, bird. Who do I need to? I don't Take think I've seen a wall bird yet, guys. I've been so fast. One more destroyed. We're done. There are two remaining and one half one. The half one's on that little parking pad next to the hangar. Help. Where are the remaining ones? Yep, kill just you just killed the half dead one. There's two remaining ones. Where are they? Uh, so there's if you're who who am I talking to? Bird. Oh, I'm rolling in from the land side. Good. Good. Four dots nice. just got a maneuver kill. Oh, oh no! Yeah, oh. well done, guys. Punching out. That was really easy. Right, we've probably got time for one more very quick one. Any ideas what you want to do? Do you guys want to do the uh, mass I-16 swarm against the AI? Sounds perfect. So is that all of us in I-16s, was that? Yep, yep. everyone who has an I-16. Uh, we're going to be in I-16s, or most of us will be, and a few in Spitfires, and we're going to go against AI at full force uh, for lols. Guys, I'm going to unpause now. Guys, you need to get airborne, do it right now. Do you want me to go and spawn the, uh, the Yeah, aircraft? get it done. As long as you can resist the urge to yank on the stick, you'll be all right. I can't resist the urge. Pretty much. That's Cortana hand cranking her gear up. Yep, that's why they're air spawns. The battle will be over before the gear gets up. Yep. <laughs> oh, it's not quite that bad. I mean, you're only halfway there. Don't worry yeah. about the two knuckleheads that are flying really close to you. Big fin on knucklehead. You're, uh, well, I mean, it's a really tight formation. Yep. It looks really good. That's important. I'm doing my job, looking sexy in a canopyless plane. Welcome to the Cortana Express. Visual bombers. Huh. That's quick. Do I think? Oh, yeah, I see them this time. Oh, man, almost there. Yep. What do you, since you, I doubt you have a, an actual crank there in your rig, what are you doing? Uh, I actually just have it so that because I have a physical uh, gear lever, I just put it to the up position and it just cranks. Nice. Uh, Peter. What is it in real life? It's a cheap button. Is it a crank in real life? Down, up, down, up, down. It is a crank in real life. Awkward. The F4F Wildcat was also a hand crank plane. Very awkward. 
in fairness, I'm pretty sure this was the first retractable gear monoplane fighter. Yeah. So. Fair, fair enough. The fact that the gear went up at all is kind of novel. Think how many times oh, I got jammed. Let's get it. Oh yeah. There we go. Gears up. Right I had a Romanian airplane in real life, and we had to uh, crank the gear when if the, if the electric wow. gear motor would. And it took something like 160 or 180 turns. Awkward. I've got a feel for that. <laughs> the I-16 should go after the bombers. The non-I-16 should take care of the uh, fighter escorts. Fair comment. Well, so you see, the problem is, once we pass the bombers, we can't go after huh. them again. How about that? Well, that's kind of problematic. That's what your head is for, Cortana. Go, little piston engine, go. Not a gunfire. Someone shooting them bombers. Hits on our saber. One bomber down. Control of. Uh, the one behind bombers were uh, maybe six. Close by here. Hits. Lots of hits. Oh. Bomber down. Set a guy on fire. Get him, spit. Lots and lots of hits. A million and one hits. They don't do any damage, Cortana! I'm getting shattered. Yeah, that's pretty much because we have AK-47s taped to the wings. Huh. I'm gonna try and dive and get underneath them or something. You can get a saber on your tail. Shit. Alright, time to play with the sabers. Watch out. I got absolutely shattered by one. Catch them, is that yes, you fire on them? Yes, gotta paper? get there because we are not catching them. Take my AKs. Fire. Hits. Suck it. Winchester. Ha. Huh. Use that face. Damn sabers are doing boom and zoom. Like knob heads and bell ends. Oh, hey, leave me uh, alone, Saber. Hits. Somebody push me. I, have, I think I have a tactic that'll work. Oh man, they're too fast, Cortana. I can't get near the Sabres, either. The bombers have just about reached the base. No. Yeah, there's nothing we can do to stop them at this point. How dare you extend? How dare you? Oh, we did okay. shoot one bomber down, We so... did shoot one. We must have had literally a thousand bombs rounds Bombs out. Ah, uh, bombs out. These little air rifles don't do much damage. Bombers have only killed two firefighters so far. Ooh, there's a lot of fire oh, over geez. by the airfield, but we never got the notification. They missed. I don't Oops. think they. I don't think they killed enough of them. I'm looking at one of the bombers. It has no rudder and is missing one half of its elevator. Hmm. And third bomber is missing its rudder. So they've all taken some damage. I got a hit on the uh, saber's tail. Pretty much got hit me in the nuts. If this is doing any damage. Uh, yeah. Hit me in the nuts. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, the, the bombers are going down. down. Oh, someone's caught them up. Well done, catchy up, man. They don't like it up, up them, you know. I really don't, do yeah. it. That's the one that I just emptied the emptied the I-16 into. Uh -oh, Winchester. Right. right. Well, there's only one good thing left to do. Mm -hmm. Only one good course of action for a gentleman. I mean, you could go attack the Gepherds and the, the rapier side at Cardinville. I'm watching you do it, Bird. Yep. You're immortalized. Tip the wing. Tip the wing. Tip the wing. You missed it, Bird. Oh, yeah! Oh, no, Bomber down. <laughs> oh, I'm so proud. I just want to go on back ground for another run. I'm so proud. Old, that bomber came around and smacked you. Yeah. <laughs> it's like he keeps getting baited by this I-16. Yeah, that's me. Overshoots. You can't get a shot, Zero two five. Ow! He shot me. Oh, he's got his gear down. He's trying out? to land. <laughs> That's him. Nice oh. shot, Ketchup. Is the V-52. There goes an engine. Just land on it, Tony. Final on. <laughs> Eastbound or, west, or westbound? Well, he's down now that I used my face. Oh, well done, bud. We're very proud of you. Yeah, he, he used his face and I lit an engine on fire. So yeah, the other one's out. Headed out over the other uh, coast. All right, guys. Um, we need to draw some conclusion from that. Um, yeah, good landing, super cap. Uh, the defending kind of nerfed B-52s was impossible. The warbirds just killed them every time. Warbirds defending against human Cold War first or second gen attackers was just impossible. You just couldn't, as long as those fighters were booming and zooming, 
you just couldn't get anywhere near them, could you? And I don't think the Warbirds won a single round like that. I'd say the Warbirds were actually able to do some damage to the Gen 1 and the Gen 2 fighters, uh, more than I would have expected. But it, you, you can tell why, you know, why everyone switched to jets as opposed to uh, sticking with the, uh, the piston engines. It may be sexier, but it's not more effective. Right. Thank you for the mission, Cortana and Cortana's guys. I hope you enjoyed it, everyone, and I'll see you later.